Hi guys, welcome to Movement Munch. My name is Amira and here on this channel we will be talking all things um, plant-based recipes, uh, workouts, wellness, movement, travel, all those good things. So if you are interested in any of those things, please stay tuned. Today I figured I would do a vegan egg roll recipe or a vegan spring roll. So I'm super excited about that. I found these at the Whole Foods. These are the Nasoya egg roll wraps and it says that they're vegan on the top. Um, so I've never tried them so I figured I'd give it a try. So a few of the things that you'll need for this recipe. We have some, I have vegetable oil right here. Vegan egg roll wraps there. Um, I have some extra firm tofu, some brown sugar, which I have in my little Ziploc bag here. And I bought this um, salad kit that has celery, green cabbage, carrots, cilantro, green onions, wonton strips, and sliced almonds. So I figured I'd give it a try, but if you don't have this mix at your local store, you can always just get cabbage and carrots, um, some sliced almonds I think we'll use. I don't know if I'll use the wonton strips in there, but yeah, this is what I'm gonna use today. And I have some tamari here. So tamari is basically like a soy sauce, but if you are gluten-free or have a gluten allergy, tamari is better because it is wheat-free. So it kind of just tastes like uh, regular soy sauce, but it is wheat-free. Um, all right, so these are all the things that we will need and let's get the cooking. I, I have my measuring cups here, my cups and my teaspoons and tablespoons here. Um, so in my little bowl, fourth cup of oil, a fourth cup of our soy sauce or our tamari sauce. Okay, pour that in there. So we're making just kind of like a, like a sweet soy sauce a sweet soy and ginger sauce. Okay, so I'm gonna add in a fourth cup of brown sugar, a quarter cup of our brown sugar, a quarter cup of vegetable oil, and a quarter cup of our soy sauce or tamari sauce. All right, I'll add a teaspoon of brown ginger and a quarter teaspoon of black pepper. I'm just gonna mix everything up really well. I rinsed off our bag of veggies. Also wash my hands, of course, because when you're cooking, you want to make sure you want to wash your hands. Um, so I washed my hands and I rinsed off that bag of that um, salad mixture that I had, which was carrots, some cabbage, some green onions, and I think it has some cilantro in here too. If you don't have the actual mix and you want to like get a cabbage and a carrot and stuff, this made about, about four cups. <laughs> So I let our filling cool down a little bit, our veggie mixture here. I wanted to cool down because I didn't want to put it completely hot into our egg roll wraps, but the sauce is a little thin. So I'm gonna add a little bit of flour just to thicken it up, just so it doesn't break through the wraps. Um, it may not be necessary, but we're gonna, we're gonna thicken it up a little bit. I'm going to use just some whole wheat flour. Let's start off with a tablespoon and see how that goes. One tablespoon of flour, and I'm gonna mix it up. Right, so it's already helping to thicken it up a little bit. 
All right, I think that's all it needed, really. I just think it was a little thin, but I think, I think that solved the problem. Still good. So this is kind of the consistency that we want. Not too runny, um, not too thick. I probably could have used a little less tofu, but that's okay. We're gonna rock with it and it's gonna work out great. I have my, this my hands off again. So now I'm gonna open up our egg rolls. So these are the ones that we're using again. Um, these are the Nasoya egg roll wraps and they are vegan. So on the back of the package, it has some instructions. Let's see. It has some instructions on the, Ugh. Oh, okay, great. All right, let's use the knife. Okay. Ooh, I don't know what I thought they were gonna feel like, but this wasn't necessarily it. Okay. Ooh, it's like pastry, like um, pre-rolled like pie dough kind of. Ooh, okay. Um, as per the instructions, place filling diagonally on the wrap, fold bottom corners over filling, roll snugly halfway through, fold and boom, nah, nah, nah. Okay, cool. Seems all right. We got this. And it says to do it diagonally. So kind of like having that diamond shape and then just filling it up, rolling this forward. And I'm rolling these sides in. I guess kind of like a little envelope. And then rolling it about okay i think okay sure let's 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 see how that goes let's try another one so i'll just do one more just so you can see what i did i'm trying not to overstuff them um so it doesn't kind of seep out the sides but let's see okay i think that's good and then roll oh wait there's two in here oops oops so I'm gonna roll it this way, roll these, and then just roll it on itself. Okay. Well, I guess I'll make the rest until all the filling is done. So I have my oil here that has been heating up. So I'm gonna do a little water test to make sure that it's hot enough. So I'm just gonna put some water on my finger and just drop it in. There we go. So let, let you know that it's hot enough. I'm just gonna drop them in. So turn the heat down just a little bit. And so then on the package for them, it said just to cook them and roll them around for about two to three minutes. So I'm just gonna let this, and also you want the the bottom wrap, like the bottom wrap to be facing down so that they don't open before they're cooked. This is what the final product looks like. So we have our vegan spring rolls here, our vegan egg rolls. So I think they look pretty good. I think they came out pretty good. Uh, I don't fry things 
a lot at all. Um, so I probably needed to turn the heat, the oil down just a little bit, but that's okay. Use some tongs and they worked out fine. Probably took about two to three minutes um, and I kind of just rolled them a lot around a little bit like the package said to do, but I think they came out pretty good. So yeah, I think they look like regular egg rolls. It's not focusing. There we go. I think they came out pretty good. We just have to have a little taste test now. I bought that like salad package that I bought came with some sesame um, dressing. So, so I think it looks good. I think it came out, I think they came out pretty yummy looking. So we just gotta taste them now. I think the filling still came out a little, a little runny. So you could probably add a little bit more flour, but I still think they came out, they still fried perfectly fine. And I don't fry foods a lot as I'm sure you could tell. So you could also put them in the oven if you want to do that but I just put them I just fried them up because the package kind of gave me the frying option I just thought it would be faster. Um, so I did it like that so I'm excited so now we just gotta taste them. All right boom we gotta give them a try taste test time. <laughs> okay so it is the moment of truth the taste test. So Janine's here with me and she's gonna taste them. She's gonna try them and let me know how they are. So I tried to do them so that you wouldn't necessarily need this little dipping sauce in the middle. So like I wanted them to taste good like without the Regardless. sauce. Regardless. Regardless. So I cut them in half so you can have that piece right there. Okay. Are we tasting them together? Yeah. Ready? Cheers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's good. Yeah. Good? I'm not gonna hold you so it's a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. Really? <laughs> Dang. Dang! This is good. Not bad, right? Mm -hmm. I think next time I'll add a little less um, tofu. I don't think it needed this much, but I, I figured it maybe like the eggy, eggy, right? Mm -hmm. Not bad, right? It didn't even need sauce, really. Mm -mm. I think it's it probably just there because it? it's cute. I cooked it in like a like a sweet soy, like a, in a dressing. I did it with like soy sauce ginger and brown sugar and some black pepper and I just like I cooked the veggies in that and then rolled them up and you like made the egg roll piece yourself no those are stall bought okay that's fine yeah yeah but um it's I used really these look oh I did not know this was they were like pre-made like egg roll wraps but but you still have like, to wrap it I did have to that part I did myself yeah um, this has wheat flour water salt wheat, gluten, vinegar, and cornstarch. No, it tastes good. It was really like the good. little wraps, and I just like wrapped them up and then I fried them on the stove. Okay. Let's say like... Oh dear, I have to rate no, them. No, <laughs> yeah, if you had to rate it out of... Let's do 10. Um, but if you had to rate them, what would you what would you give them? Okay, so this is what we were clarifying. Okay. Rating on pure taste, Okay. 10. Okay. Rating on comparison to Chinese... Like traditional egg, yeah. egg rolls? Like an eight. Okay, cool. But I would give you like a hundred thousand percent for the fact that you made egg rolls. Okay. If I put one on a plate for you right now, I'd would still you go eat, eat it? it? Oh, absolutely. Okay, cool. No, absolutely. I'll take that. It was my but first time making egg rolls. So. All right. I think we could say this one was a success. I really think so too. Oh. <laughs> All right, well, if you enjoyed this video, thank you for joining me. You can comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, and if there's anything else that you would like to see, you can leave it in the comments below. And follow me on Instagram at Move and Munch. Um, and I also have the blog as well, where recipes are posted up there as well. And you can be, well, it will be on moveandmunch.com. So if you like what you saw, give it a thumbs up and I will see you soon. Bye bye. It's just. <laughs> Do you have a better side? Do you want to be on the ring? Um. Uh, <laughs> what? So we've already eaten like several. Several That's now, so it's, <laughs> the plate has dwindled since. I don't know, I'm so camera shy. <laughs> oh, it's recording. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm fine. You should do a bloopers. Everybody loves bloopers. You can also follow me on Move and Munch. Um, oh. <laughs> Yay, bloopers! Should I have waved too? No, okay. perfect. <laughs> <laughs>